Hello, I'm Martin Siegler, former associate professor of mathematics at Darmstadt Technical University in Germany and since five years proud associate professor of computer science at KAIST. On the intersection between both areas, between mathematics and computer science is numerics. Science, engineering, economics and mathematics itself all involve complicated equations that usually admit no exact solution. Instead, numerical calculations are used to solve them approximately. Since the 1930s, often as replacements of expensive or dangerous experiments. 1985 marked the beginning of a veritable numerical revolution. 35 years ago, the IEEE floating point standard was introduced, immediately followed by a hardware support that would drastically accelerate calculations, a pinnacle of electrical engineering. These past 35 years have seen computing evolve from a hacker's paradise to a scientific discipline. As Moore's law is reaching its limitation, the goals of research in computer science have shifted from faster and bigger to convenient, rigorous and elegant, from electrical engineering to computer science. The design of algorithm has replaced heuristical hacking, Biskoff's analysis have replaced empirical timing measurements, complexity theory allows to mathematically prove algorithms optimal, formal verification has replaced testing and debugging, abstract data times and object-oriented programming hide technical details such as CPU or registers. But this paradigm shift from electrical engineering to computer science has been restricted to the processing of discrete data. For the past decades, computer science kept turning a blind eye on the processing of continuous quantities, although these are ubiquitous in applications, scalar and vector fields, differential operators, etc. Still nowadays, continuous data is commonly treated by discretization. But discretizing a continuous problem adds artifacts and break symmetries as well as other beneficial properties of the original formulation. For example, floating point numbers violate the associative and distributive law, leading to many bugs buried in most numerical codes, such as those that led to the collapse of the computer-designed Sleipner AOL platform or the failure of the Ariane 5 Maiden Flight 501. Discretization voids all the reasons that real calculus has been developed in the first place completeness, intermediate value, and fixed point theorems. We develop computer science for numerics in order to fill this huge blind spot in the science of processing continuous data, ready for the second numerical revolution. The IRAM library, developed in Germany, supports real numbers exactly as abstract data type devoid of rounding errors, in full agreement with mathematics. It hides floating point computations behind a layer of clean and ideal abstractions, just like high-level programming language hide bits and bytes and processor details. Building on the reliability of these exact real numbers are vectors and matrices and tensors, polynomials, converging sequences, analytic and smooth functions. Mathematically, these constitute expansions of structures in the sense of model theory. Computationally, they form a hierarchy of continuous abstract data types. And together, they allow to transfer constructive proofs from calculus 1, 2, 3, 4 directly and automatically into reliable algorithms. IEEE floating point numbers are a pinnacle of electrical engineering like modern CPUs. Computer science has added the abstractions that allow for the convenience of contemporary computers. Its powerful and rigorous methods underlie the development of large-scale software such as computer algebra systems. We extend this to the development of computer analysis system, turnkey numerics combining the knowledge of world experts in pure and applied mathematics with the reliability of computer science. Thank you.